Boris Johnson was warned that more fishing rows with the EU are likely to erupt following Britain's licensing conflict with France, fishing industry leader Barry Dees told Express. French fishermen are preparing to block the Channel Tunnel and the port of Calais. It is in protest at the UK's failure to grant them more fishing licenses since Brexit. Members of the Fishermen's Association said a large number of vehicles will be used to block the tunnel. It will likely disrupt the trade in goods that go back and forth between the UK and France by road and rail. The two are currently at loggerheads over a number of issues, including the migrant crisis. The fishing row surrounds a dispute over the number of licenses the UK has allocated to French boats to allow them to fish in British waters since the UK left the EU's rules and regulations behind earlier this year. A Downing Street spokesman said the government is disappointed by threats of protest activity. They continued, it will be a matter for the French to ensure that there are no illegal actions and that trade is not affected. We continue to monitor the situation closely. The rail will likely be one in a string of further friction between the UK and EU over fishing, according to Barry Dees, chief executive of the National Federation of Fishermen's Organisations, NFFO. He told Express.co.uk, going forward, yes, I think there's the potential for more friction. As we diverge from the common fisheries policy, I think there will be scope. There's a legal obligation on both the UK and the EU on the UN law of the sea and a moral obligation, because we share stocks. If we don't manage them in a proper way the fisheries and the stocks are under jeopardy. There will be splats, but there's this overriding obligation to act in a cooperative way, but you do get splats between coastal states. The obligation Mr. Dees speaks of has yet to come into play between the UK and France.